hear the words West Point, you automatically think of football. WCBI Sports' Chris Bolton was able to learn more about one of the unsung heroes who helps make this program so special. And it's probably one of the best programs in the, in the state and in, in the country. The West Point Green Wave are a powerhouse in Mississippi high school football. Winners of four of the last five Class 5A state championships and tied with South Panola for the crown of the most titles in the state. One person who's been along for the ride with head coach Chris Chambliss is team manager Tyler Gal, son of assistant coach Roger Burden. Tyler and the Green Wave go back. He's been helping with the team since seventh grade. They just know what we want done every day, and we don't have to tell them twice to do anything. A lot of times, we don't have to tell them one time to do it. Tyler recently graduated from the access program offered by Mississippi State University for students with intellectual and developmental disabilities. He's taking many of the skills he's learned from access to help the Green Wave stay on top on the gridiron. Help me out so much throughout life and I won't be here today because wouldn't be here with job schools and pen schools all that if it wasn't for access today. We're really grateful for our, our partnership with the MSU football team in providing him such a high quality internship and that's paid off you know now he's still connected with West Point. He's just become part of the family. It's been pretty special to see and, and the players love him. Uh, they love Cortez. They love those guys because they know that that uh Things are going to get done, and, and when the, even when the players need something, they're going to make sure they get it. The Green Wave won four consecutive titles from 2016 to 2019. If you ask Tyler, the key to it all has been hard work. It's a once in a lifetime. Coaches work hard. I work hard. My, one of my managers, Cortez. We all we all work hard. Hard. We all work as a team, as a whole unit. He's taught us uh, that that. You meet challenges, you face them head on, and, and and you persevere. Tyler has a love not only for West Point, but also in helping teams. A love he says he'll carry with him for the rest of his life. And this is what I'm going to die doing. I love it so much that I can't live without it. I love West Point football and wherever God puts me, if he puts me in West Point my whole life, or he puts me at State or anywhere else, I'm going to do the best as a I can. I'm planning on being in West Point for the rest of my life. Reporting, Chris Bolton, WCBI Sports.